Hi everyone, welcome back to Sunset Talk. Um, yes, I am in my car today. I am waiting to go into work. Um, waiting for someone to get here to unlock the doors. Got here a little early today. Um, but today I wanted to talk about one of the things um, that no one really prepares you for, for moving out and on your own. Whether you have a roommate or not, um, one of the things that is very prevalent is just being alone a lot of the time um and like i said whether you have a roommate or if you're living alone um regardless you are completely independent you are on your own schedule doing your own things and most likely you are used to either living at home with your families with someone almost all the time there or living on a college campus with probably roommates and also just in a compact area with a ton of people your age whereas when you move out you're in the real world and there's a plethora of age groups and types of people and all sorts of stuff so I've really found that there is just a lot of time solitary time that I've been classifying as me time um, where you are able to kind of reflect and just do your own thing. And it's really important how you utilize that time. You have to recognize that, yes, sometimes this time could be lonely, but you could also use it for many other things like bettering yourself, whether that's working out or reading or going exploring if you're in a new town or something like that. So um, I think it's important to kind of spin it and know that it's positive it's not always a negative thing that it's just a change you're not used to it and it's definitely um and something to adapt to but it's new and exciting and um this is one of the only times in your life you're going to have so much time and so much time for yourself at this point in your 20s it really is all about yourself um and not in a selfish way just in a self-reflecting growth discovery all of that sort of good stuff that this is the time to have your me time and be able to find who you want to be and who you are and what you like to do and all of that stuff so um it's important to use that me time to kind of explain to yourself like who you are what you want to do all that's good stuff and i just love to bring this to i guess just to speak it out because it is something that i didn't really wasn't really prepared for to obviously i knew i was going to be independent and on my own but i didn't really know how much time i was going to have to myself and you're literally making every decision for yourself which sounds like Oh, Phoebe, like, that's so obvious. Like, obviously, you're on your own. You're going to have a lot of time on your hands for yourself. But it really is something that I was not expecting to have so much time, I guess. Especially because I live with a roommate. Really thought that it would just be just like college. But it definitely is different. You are, like, if you're like me, you're working a 9 to 5. You have a schedule. You have a commute. You have work to do. And bills to pay groceries to get all that stuff um so it's just it's the real world but um but it's totally normal and i'm sure there's plenty of other 20 somethings living through the same thing as me and i hope that someone can relate to this um but on that note i'm gonna sign off and go into work um another nine to five day ahead can't wait um and i hope to talk to you guys soon